Hi pals, coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, the Vice team is investigating things including Cuban agents, the feds, Izzy, and bull semen. In the episode, The Cows of October. On this week in Vice, we'll be taking a look back when this episode of Miami Vice aired from January 25th to February 7th, 1988, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on January 31st, the Washington Redskins would defeat the Denver Broncos in Super Bowl 22 by a whopping 32 points with the final score of 42 to 10. The Redskins would score 35 unanswered points in the second quarter and sealing their victory early. Doug Williams would win the Super Bowl MVP and is the first African-American quarterback to win the big game. In music, moving on to the top of the Hot 100 for their first and only song to reach number one is Need You Tonight by NXS. From the album Kick, it is easily the most known song from the band, even if you only recognize it from its amazing music video. In movies, Good Morning Vietnam is going to spend the next six weeks at the top of the box office, so we're going to have to go deep into the archives of movies released in 1988. Lucky for us, some of the greatest action movies of the decade come out, including, in very short order, Action Jackson and Bloodsport. This week, we'll be looking at something slightly different, though. Directed by John Hughes and starring Kevin Bacon and Elizabeth McGovern is the romantic comedy film She's Having a Baby. It's one of the few Hughes movies that received both negative reviews and wasn't a financial success and that's everything you need to know that was happening when my advice was king be sure to join us on go with the heat at go with the i'd love to hear from you email the show go with the heat at gmail.com or follow us on twitter at go with the heat that's all for this week bye pals